what I'm saying? Bro's really trying to come at me crazy. Bro gonna say, dude, you should really pull those jelly beans out your nose. God's plan. I can't do this on my own. Hey, no. Hey. Someone watching this shit close. Yup. Yeah. Hey man, say man, it's your boy Daddy the Great. B O I N I B O Y, you don't know we rockin' dog in the stand. Me man, and today I'm coming at y'all with a different kind of video, man. You feel me? This is my first time. You know what I'm saying? Technically having to make, make not having to make a video, but in a situation to make a video like this. You feel me? So as y'all can tell by the title, man, I am re I am basically responding to hate comments on my MGK and my Eminem diss track reactions. You feel me? Now before I even get into the re before I even get into the hate comments and stuff like that, man, I just want to go over one or two things. Actually, you feel me? Now what you know I'm saying? Stuff like this, you know what I'm saying? Don't even really bother me. You feel me? Like I don't be getting bothered by no hate comments and shit because you know what I'm saying? Where I grew up, nigga, this is all we did was talk shit to each other. You feel me? Talk shit with random niggas. You know what I'm saying? And just go back and forth and all types of shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So to me, this kind of stuff is funny to me. You know what I'm saying? I don't let nothing like this really get to my head because one, like, I don't know you. You know what I'm saying? You don't know me. You just somebody on the end of a computer screen just talking crazy. You feel me? Just trying to go crazy. So me personally, I don't let none of that bother me. You know what I'm saying? To me, it's fun because, you know what I'm saying? You niggas got the right one. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Most of these other YouTubers and stuff like that, you'll just comment or whatever that I like they ain't see it and they ain't gonna say nothing. No, nigga. I'm in comment sections too. You feel me? I I'm typing right back, you know what I'm saying? Because I had, I was in there going back and forth with a couple niggas, you know what I'm saying? And I don't, and me personally, it's funny to me. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all really be getting mad, but I don't really care. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to have fun doing it, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? And then the second thing, though, is some of you niggas, bro, y'all some real, y'all is some real goofies. You know what I'm saying? Some <laughs> ass niggas, you know what I'm saying? Y'all really goofy as hell. You know what I'm saying? And this is why. Because I most of the hate comments, you know what I'm saying? Most of the hate comments that I got was around this certain this certain subject. So I'm like, okay, let me go ahead and explain this at the beginning of the video so I can make this clear for everybody. You know what I'm saying? So that nobody gets this confused. Now, hold on, let me slide over a little bit. I'm gonna put it like right here. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be a picture of the thumbnail from my MGK on my or my MGK uh reaction. You know what I'm saying? So the thumbnail gonna be right here, you feel me? On the thumbnail I have on there where it says, rest in peace uh to the rap god. And it has an exclamation point question mark. Now a lot of niggas was basically, you niggas was basically assuming that I like basically saying assuming that I'm saying uh rest in peace to the rap god. You know what I'm saying? That's that's not what I'm saying at all. You know what I'm saying? It says, rest in peace to the rap god. Exclamation point. You know what I'm saying? That point, that means it's serious. Points out the seriousness. Now hold on, y'all, because this is the part that all of you niggas seem to miss. Now I don't know if you niggas is either like, y'all just can't read. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't know grammar. You know what I'm saying? Or y'all just out here uh, dick riding other people's comments trying to best me so you don't feel like you left out, you know what I'm saying? So you can have something to talk about. And if that's what y'all want, I'm gonna need you to get the wood out your mouth, you know what I'm saying? Get that dick out your mouth with that weird shit, you know what I'm saying? But after the exclamation point, I got a question mark. Now, what does a question mark mean? What does it mean? It, thank you, it means it's a question. Thank you, it means it's a question. So I said, rest in peace to the rap god, exclamation point, which means seriousness, question mark, which points out the seriousness in the question. That's a question. You know what I'm saying? I'm asking you, rest in peace to the rap god? Now that's up to you to answer that. You know what I'm saying? You supposed to answer that. Oh, yeah, rest in peace to the rap god, da 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 he got killed, or no, 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 hell no, he ain't get killed, do 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 You know what I'm saying? That's a question for y'all to answer. I'm not stating rest in peace to the rap god. I'm not saying that because I've been with Eminem from the jump, so I already knew Eminem was going to kill, bro. You know what I'm saying? Now, if I had put rest in peace to the rap god, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, nigga, that's a statement. I'm literally telling you rest in peace to the rap god. It's not a question. I'm telling you that. You know what I'm saying? I didn't put that. That's why I specifically put exclamation point question mark. You feel me? So you nigga, a lot of you niggas was asking me about that. And then I'm gonna put a, a picture of the title right here as well. Because I did the same thing in the title. And I said he ended Eminem's career. Exclamation point question mark. That is also another question for you guys to answer. That's for the audience. That's for the fans. That's for the subs. That's not me telling y'all. You know what I'm saying? Now if I were to put question mark, I mean exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. 
then that's a statement. I'm actually telling y'all that he ended Eminem's career. That's actually that's a question. You feel me? So that's where I think a lot. That's where I think a lot of the hate comments uh, spawned it from. A lot of you niggas was thinking I was telling y'all that he actually did this and did that, and I was saying blah 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 blah. You know what I'm saying? Which wasn't the case at all. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I had to make that real clear for y'all. And be so before I even get into the video, y'all already know what I'm on. You know what I'm saying? So when I start reading these hate comments and stuff like that, then y'all like, okay, so that's really not what he was saying. He was really saying this. We all just took it the wrong way. Da, 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 da. You know what I'm saying? The first hate comment that I got was, bro said, you say you've been on Eminem's side, but title your stupid video as MGK ending Eminem's career. Question mark, exclamation point. He even put that in there. You're a fucking tool, just like MGK, trying to trying to use big names to get yourself ahead. You're fake as fuck. My nigga, how am I fake, my nigga? I don't do nothing but keep it 100 G real. I keep it G real. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't even gonna make this video, but today I got time, cuz. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, this nigga said I'm fake as hell, and I'm using big names to get ahead. My nigga, how am I using a big name to get ahead? My nigga, it's a reaction video. Nigga, I'm reacting to a video. That don't make no sense. Now, if I'm in that motherfucker, like, if I'm making a video, you feel me, and I'm doing, like, a vlog or something, and I'm outside playing basketball, and then I'm out there talking about some, like, oh, um, I'm out there, uh, I just dunked on Michael Jordan, da 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 or something like that, basically trying to throw somebody's name in there for clout, somebody that got clout type shit, if I'm trying to use their name for some clout, that's different, nigga, then I'd be like, okay, I'm trying to use somebody to get ahead, nigga, this is a reaction video, at the end of the title, it even has reaction in there, nigga, so I'm reacting to this video, so there's no way I'm using a nigga name to get some clout if I'm reacting to his shit. Like, come on, my guy. That don't make to me. That don't make no sense. You know what I'm saying? But you ain't think I was gonna get in there responding. But before I even got a chance to respond, somebody else was up in there. You know what I'm saying? Co-signing with this nigga. Co-signing. You feel me, bro? Somebody else was in there like this. They said he just want he just want viewers. He need. Well, he didn't even say viewers. I tried to correct that for him. He said he just want viewer. He need viewer. He got no viewer. 1.5k sub only. He is desperate, lol. One, nigga, you can't even, you don't even got good grammar while you in there trying to talk, you feel me? <laughs> you don't even got good grammar, so I'm really finna bag you. And yeah, I got 1.5k subs, you know what I'm saying? You gotta start somewhere, right? Niggas don't just jump on YouTube and automatically have a million, you know what I'm saying? We gotta start off at that 1.5, you feel me? Team Greatness, we finna go crazy, you hear me? You know what I'm saying? So, 1.5k now, huh, 10k. Next year, you know what I'm saying? 10K by the uh, beginning of next year, you feel me? We trying to go crazy, you know what I'm saying? I ain't even, and, and I ain't even released none of my best content, you know what I'm saying? I'm sick, bruh, y'all really don't understand how much content I got lined up for y'all, bro. I got so, bruh, hold on, bro. Let me even, bro. I'm gonna even just show y'all, bro. Look, bro, look, bro, before I even go, bro, this is my video ideas list, bro. I got all this, I got all this content right here for y'all, you feel me? All this content, and I ain't even released none yet, you feel me? I'm sick, bruh. I'm saving all my content, bruh. And then, when YouTube stop playing and monetize me, we finna just go dumb. I'm gonna have so much banger content for y'all, you feel me? That's just a smart business move for me. You know what I'm saying? Bro, we gonna be stupid lit, I'm telling you. But back to bro, you know what I'm saying? You don't even know how to spell, you know what I'm saying? You just co-signing saying I'm desperate. How am I desperate, my nigga? I don't understand how I'm desperate. You know what I'm saying? I'm reacting to somebody else's shit, giving my opinion on somebody else's stuff, so I don't understand how I'm desperate. But you know, y'all gonna say what y'all gonna say, you feel me? Because as soon as you get a little sliver of popping this, you always gonna have the haters come through trying to hate, you know what I'm saying? Niggas just gonna hate just because. And to me, I don't care because... I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing. I'm gonna do what I wanna do when I wanna do it, who I wanna do it with. You feel me? We just gonna keep going crazy. And I'm gonna keep uploading these bangers. We gonna win regardless. Whether they wanna stop us or not, Team Greatness, we gonna win regardless. Can't nobody stop what God already has planned for us. You feel me? It's, it's inevitable. You know what I'm saying? They can't stop it. You know what I'm saying? But then I got into the comment section, not coming it back to both of them. You feel me? And then Bro said. The first dude, not the second dude that didn't have no grammar, the first dude that was talking about how I'm using somebody to get ahead or whatever, he gonna say, dude, in the video itself, you call MGK your guy. You call MGK your guy. Bro, I call everybody my guy. You know what I'm saying? Hey, bro, any bro, if you've been watching my videos for a minute, 
know what I'm saying? Or even if you haven't been watching my videos for a minute, if you've seen three or more, two, three, four more of my videos, bro, you see in my video every time I'm talking about somebody, I say my guy. So just because I say my guy, that don't mean that I'm leaning to this side or I'm leaning to that side. You feel me? I call him and then my guy. I call you my guy. I call anybody my guy. In the comment section, I'll be replying to people's comments saying my guy. So that's already uh irrelevant. Thank you. And then he gonna say, while saying you've been wanting to see someone come at Eminem while on top of saying you don't even listen to Eminem's album, fool. Bruh. Sometimes, bro, I don't even be wanting to respond to these niggas, bro. Like, I just be doing this for fun, you feel me? Just because I be bored sometimes, and I just be like, fuck it. Let me get here and just talk a little bit of shit to somebody, you feel me? Because they talking shit. But, bro, of course I wanted to see somebody come at Eminem, bro. Who doesn't? This is what everybody wanted to see, you know what I'm saying? To everybody who's actually hip-hop fans, bro, hip-hop is dead, bro. You know what I'm saying? Hip-hop, bro, there's no interest in hip-hop like that, bro. You know what I'm saying? The closest thing we got to some interest in hip-hop was when Drake and Pusha T was going at it. You know what I'm saying? But Pusha T came and sent that diss to Drake, and Drake didn't even respond. Everybody wanted to see that beef. You know what I'm saying? So since Drake didn't respond, that beef was basically dead. Then hip-hop ain't got nothing interesting going on. And then all of a sudden, somebody want to come at Eminem? The king? The one that's on the throne? Nigga? Of course we want to see somebody come at Eminem. Because nobody's done it. That means that brings that brings more interest in the hip hop. You know what I'm saying? We want to see a little bit of stirred up. You know what I'm saying? We want to see a little bit of yin and yang. We don't want to just see a little yin, a little yang. We want to see both. That's what makes things good. We want to see both sides. You feel me? So of course I want to see somebody coming at Eminem. That don't mean like oh I want to see Eminem fall off the throne. Da 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 da. da. No. I want to see somebody come at Eminem, and then I want to see Eminem come back and destroy their ass, just like he did with Killshot. Came through and destroyed them. You know what I'm saying? Killshot made MGK's disc look like child's play. You feel me? So, of course, I wanted to see that. And no, I didn't listen to Eminem's album. I still haven't listened to Eminem's album. You know what I'm saying? I don't even listen to MGK. So, what does that have to do with anything? I don't listen to neither one of them niggas like that. You know what I'm saying? At least not no more. I listen to Eminem's old stuff. I don't listen to his new stuff. And I, the only song, like I told you, the only song I know by uh, MGK is Wild Boy. You feel me? But anyways, man, on to the next comment. You feel me? This person said... Actually, two people said, I'm going to just put both of them in there right now. One of them said, that was the worst reaction I ever saw. And then the other one said, his reaction shit, regret that I ever even watched this reaction. Hey, man, you know what I'm saying? Y'all going to have your own opinion, you feel me? I'm not tripping. <laughs> hey, at least y'all came through, you know what I'm saying? Got a quick little view, you know what I'm saying? Y'all show me some love, you feel me? I'm going to show y'all some love, too, you feel me? If you ain't like it, unfortunately... There's not much I could do about that, you know what I'm saying? You just gonna have to stop watching the channel, you know what I'm saying? It's ugly, I don't know what to tell you. And then somebody else gonna say, attention seeker. How am I an attention seeker? How, bro? Please, please somebody tell me. Because I, I went in there, bro, and I asked him the same question. I said, how am I an attention seeker, bro? He gonna say, your title, da 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 That goes back to, like I said at the beginning, niggas don't know grammar, niggas don't read, you know what I'm saying? They don't know what they talking about, niggas just be talking. You know what I'm saying? So, bro is just talking out his neck, you know what I'm saying? I explained that at the beginning of the video, so I'm not even going, you know what I'm saying, explain, you know what I'm saying, what I already explained to this nigga, bro. And then, I don't know if bro was coming in there trying to flame a little bit or what, but this, this nigga gonna say, you look like 50 Cent a little bit. And then bro ass gonna say, bro, bro said I look like a nigga that's in there. All I really need is a little bit. Not a lot, baby girl, just a little bit. We can head to the crib in a little bit. I can show you how I live in a little bit. Looking nice. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if you was trying to flame me, say I look like 50 or what. But I'm gonna give you a pass, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna let you slide on that one. You feel me? I ain't gonna... I ain't gonna flame you for that, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna give you a pass, you know what I'm saying? And then somebody else gonna say, bet you feel fucking stupid now. Rest in peace, MGK. No, my nigga, I don't feel stupid. <laughs> I've been waiting for MGK to lose the whole time. I already explained that in the beginning, so I'm really not gonna explain that to you, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, a lot of these hate comments was really coming from the title and the, uh, and the uh, thumbnail, you feel me, just because niggas can't read or niggas just don't take the time to read or these niggas just dick riding, one of the three, you feel me? But somebody else said, nigga, you suck, you whack, your hair, whack, your face, whack, me, I'm tight as fuck, looking nice. Nah, that nigga said, nigga, you suck, you whack, what do you say about Haley, nigga, you corny. 
how am I corny? You know what I'm saying? Obviously, you must not have been paying attention to the bit because Eminem even said it himself in the press conferences and shit that MGK was talking about Haley. And then the reference that he brought up in the song was just a bonus to that, you feel me? Which made Eminem even, you know what I'm saying, more pissed to have to re respond to this nigga. But... You obviously ain't that educated on the beef, you feel me? So we ain't even going, you know what I'm saying? We not even going to get into it. You feel me? And then somebody else going to say, you're clapping like a little girl. Look, my nigga. I don't care. Looking nice. You know what I'm saying? That Sometimes you got to clap, you know what I'm saying? Put, put, some, put some emphasis on what you're trying to say. You know what I'm saying? I'll be like, okay. Now, if I'm like... Okay, now you know what I'm saying you know what's up. You know what I'm saying that's for the you know what I'm saying that's what the that's what the girls be on. You know what I'm saying, but hey, you know what I'm saying, fuck it. You know what I'm saying, fuck it. You know what I'm saying, I'ma do it too. Shit, who cares, my nigga? You know what I'm saying? And then somebody else came in there. I'm I'm pretty positive, bro, was just trolling, but I was trolling right with him, so I ain't even care. But bro said just came to dislike, and I said thanks, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? And he was like, no problem. Ugly ass. So I know bro's probably up in there just trolling and shit, but we gonna put that in there anyway. You know what I'm saying? I don't even care. Now this dude right here, bruh, you know what I'm saying? Bro is really trying to come at me crazy. Bro gonna say, dude, you should really pull those jelly beans out your nose. I ain't gonna lie, that jelly bean shit was kind of funny though, my nigga, you know what I'm saying? That nigga, you know what I'm saying? That nigga got me laughing a little bit, you feel me? But jelly beans? Look, I mean, hold on, let me see. I mean, my nostrils. I mean, they kind of big, you know, they, they just a little bit big, you know what I'm saying? But, I mean, they ain't that big, but nigga, stop looking at my nose, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Stop looking at my nose, boy. You know what I'm saying? What you looking at, nigga? You know what I'm saying? But he said, thinking MGK ruined Eminem's career, you're a tardo. Nigga, I ain't heard nobody use tardo, boy, since I was in like third grade or something. You know what I'm saying? Get. But anyway, like I said before, though, that had to do with what I said at the beginning, bro. Because, uh, bro, come on, man. Y'all know I ain't think Eminem, you know I ain't think MGK killed Eminem, bro. Come on, dog. Stop playing with me. Stop playing. Stop playing with me. And then for the final comment, bro, you know what I'm saying? Bro actually deleted his comment after I commented back to him. So, you know what I'm saying? I couldn't, I, I didn't even think to screenshot it ahead of time. So I didn't get this comment on there. But bro said, I don't even, he said, he was like, I don't even know you, but you call yourself Daddy the Great, so I know in, uh, in prison, and I don't know much about prison, but if you were in prison, you would be holding pockets. If anybody don't know what holding pockets mean, he's basically saying that, nigga, since I call myself Daddy the Great, in prison, I, uh, the prison niggas will be trying to make me they bitch. Well, I'm going to let you be. I'm going to be the first to let you know, as I told you in the comment section, nigga. You know what I'm saying? These videos that I'll be making, bro, that's for strictly entertainment purposes only. You know what I'm saying? Niggas really ain't talking no shit in person. Niggas ain't trying none of that shit in person. Because I ain't going for none of that. I ain't going. You know what I'm saying? If you coming at me crazy in person, you know what I'm saying? You gonna have to see me or something. Whatever you trying to do, we can make it happen, Captain. You know what I'm saying? If you, you want to get in the street, you want to get down, we can get down. Simple. You know what I'm saying? We can box. What's up? But you know what I'm saying? It's not even, you know what I'm saying? It's not even nothing like that, you feel me? Because I ain't on no shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Because I know y'all just be in there talking and stuff, you feel me? So I just be in there talking too, you feel me? And, but let's not get it fucked up though. If you, you know what I'm saying? If you really trying to settle some shit, we can really settle something. But you feel me? It's nothing but positivity. There's <coughs> nothing but positivity on the channel, you feel me? But yeah, though, let's not get it twisted. This is only for entertainment purposes. We in real life, we you know what I'm saying we could go. You know what I'm saying? The real, the real gonna mess with me regardless. You feel me? The real niggas gonna mess with me regardless. Whether my name Daddy the Great, whatever my name is and shit. Like if you if you come through my channel or something, you like, oh, I can't fuck with bro because his name Daddy the Great. Da 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 da. Then nigga, you're lame. As a person, you're lame, my nigga. Because I got niggas and females that follow the channel, that sub to the channel, that fuck with me heavy. You know what I'm saying, nigga. If, if you got a problem, nigga, call me DTG. You know what I'm saying? Call me TG. Call me D. Nigga, I got niggas call me D, DTG. You know what I'm saying? All type of shit. So, nigga, if you worried about the name or some shit, my nigga, it's either one, nigga, you you insecure about yourself, nigga, something wrong with your masculinity or something, my nigga, or, nigga, you just lame as hell. You know what I'm saying? Because the real gonna fuck with me regardless. You know what I'm saying? And if you ain't, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? It ain't nothing that personal. You hear me? You know what I'm saying? 
And then I had came in, I had commented back to him or whatever, you know what I'm saying? And then bro gonna bro gonna delete his comment though, you feel me? So that's how I know he was really just talking. And most of the people that's really in there talking be people that don't got no profile pictures on there. You know what I'm saying? They don't got no profile pictures. They just be on there just you know what I'm saying? Probably 15, 12, 13 and shit talking shit. You know what I'm saying? So I don't really be paying y'all no money. You feel I just be chilling, you know what I'm saying? But um that was really just me responding to some of the hate comments, man. You know what I'm saying? I really had to just put that out there. You know what I'm saying? So people could really understand what, you know what I'm saying, what was going on in the video and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of y'all really didn't understand. You feel me? So I just had to make this, you know what I'm saying? Because one, it's my first time, you know what I'm saying, receiving some hate comments. You know what I'm saying? And I just wanted to do it. You feel me? Because it's fun to me. You know what I'm saying? I like doing this. You know what I'm saying? If you ever want to get flamed and get, you know what I'm saying, hit me. I'll flame you for sure. You know what I'm saying? I have fun doing this. You feel me? But um, hit that like button, man. Hit that subscribe button if you new, man. Get me on social media, man. We lit on that side too as well, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, man. We just hey, <laughs> hey, y'all. We waiting on YouTube. We waiting on YouTube. Once YouTube monetize the kid, man, I'm finna start dropping all these bangers. You know what I'm saying? Y'all seen the list? I got hella videos waiting for y'all. You know what I'm saying? So. As soon as they stop playing, you feel me? I'm finna just be dropping banger after banger after banger. You know what I'm saying? Y'all think we going crazy right now? Nah, bro. These reactions was just to get us there. You know what I'm saying? To get us to the monetized state. We still gonna be doing reactions. But these bangers that I got lined up is really gonna set the channel off. You feel me? We really gonna set off and go dumb. You feel me? So just stay tuned for those, man. We finna go stupid. You feel me? Hey, man, I thank everybody for showing me the love and support y'all been showing me, man. It's been a crazy ass two months. You feel me? And hey. We just gonna keep grinding for y'all. We finna keep going crazy. But um, like I said, man, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button if you're new, man. And it's your boy Daddy the Great signing out, man. Gang. Yeah. Now that the video's over, man, for all you niggas that was in the comment section hating, bro. For all of you niggas that was in the comment section hating, this is all I gotta say for y'all, man. Hey, prices just went up. I, I control shit, robots, I hit the